my name is Andy, and I'm from the Rhode Island School of Design in the U.S. There's a lot of cynicism right now about design and its role in the world, and a lot of skepticism about you know, what can we actually do as designers to affect social change. And so my work at RISD, this is some of it, um, is about how we need to not mo only think about a bottom-up process of social change, but think about it from the inside out as well. And this is how we look at older people. There are, uh, this is the charity that we worked with, Help the Age at Age Concern, and they're, they're always smiling because we're afraid they're going to die. And, uh, and there's like sort of like old people typography, you know. <laughs> and uh, the only time we sort of talk about older people and sex is when you put like an old man's head on a younger man's body to sell Viagra. So um, a lot of my work at RISD centers around sort of these ideas. And for some reason, I've also, I'm also fascinated by pop music, right? And uh, a lot of people think of pop music as this like really superficial thing that just uh, has a bunch of like surface spectacle. This is a poster about the rapper Eminem, and some people think of him as just some superficial misogynist. But when you get at the heart of it, he talks about losing himself in music because he has to. As a, as a young rapper growing up in the streets of Detroit, he has to lose himself in music because his food stamps don't buy diapers. Design doesn't, is not a cure-all panacea for you know, all the world's problems, but it's part of a constellation of things that we can bring to bear on our ideas, and that we can build empathy by registering the idea that it sort of cuts a path you know, f for hope to become evident in people's lives. And I think that's what I'm committed to as a designer.